So here I am at Cape Brianga Lighthouse, the northernmost point of New Zealand. Go any further north and you fall into the Pacific Ocean. And my destination is there, Bluff. 1500 k's um, as the bird flies, probably about 3000 k's the way I'm going. So let's get started. So I'm getting started. The uh, thing that they're judging by the road in seems to be hills. It's a bit intimidating looking. Uh, so I've set my sights for Takao instead of Pukunui on the way up, um, the way down. So let's see how it goes. So time until first flat tyre, about five minutes. Damn. Okay, so things I learned in the first minutes of the first day. Uh, number one, New Zealand rural roads are way rougher than I thought. They really bump things around. Number two, nothing is bolted as tightly as you think it is and it will go askew on a New Zealand rural road. Number three, changing rear tyres is a pain, but not as much of a pain as I thought it was. And I think that's about it. So, more things I've learned. Well, I climb incredibly boring hill. Um, until I can figure out a really secure mount for the GoPro, it's a liability. Uh, it tends to get shaken out of place and get fouled up with pedals. So, if you don't see much GoPro footage in today's update, that's why. The phone mount, on the other hand, is surprisingly secure, more so than I thought it would be. It shows no signs of even shaking around uh, while I'm going at high speed. And uh, cycling gloves on a trike, turns out, are useless. Their hands are better. So I just got to Tikal, but uh, no sign of the support. Pretty worn out, uh, sore knees, sore legs. A bit worried about the knees, but uh, decided I'll continue on at a really low pace. Either I get to Pukanui or 